anticlimactic way to make the playoffs? Or? Well, we're in the playoffs. That's the number one thing. And uh, like I said, uh, I don't know how many weeks I've been here, but if uh, I told everyone we're, we're going to make the playoffs, I think everyone would be pretty excited about that moving forward. Uh, not the way you want to go in it, but uh, they did a hell of a job. We've we've taken a lot of energy and a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of bite out of the team trying to get here too. So down the stretch, uh, I think the guys were a little disappointed in tonight's game because uh, they wanted more. So, and uh, you know, get a day off and back to work and ready for Calgary and get ready for the playoffs. I mean, uh, our fans are great uh, supporting us and uh, we try to clinch it here at home and move forward. That's uh, it's a pretty exciting time. You're in the playoff National Hockey League. Only 16 of you make it out of 30. That's the bottom line for me. And I'll just tell you, I've been in this business a long time, so be happy with that. Does it feel weird to have all the excitement of the playoffs with four straight losses? Um, no, not even worried about it, Chad, honestly. I mean, uh, I didn't expect it, but uh, we we move on. Now we focus on uh, Calgary game, and, and then, uh, you know, maybe this will loosen some guys up. Maybe they think they had a, you know, we we try to make plays that aren't there that we're usually doing, and, and we've got to do it better in our, our checking and uh, our penalty kill, uh, you know, we got to, better clearing attempts. We've been up two goals out of the four in the last three games are clearing attempts that uh, we've got to do a better job on. What, overall, uh, getting ready for next week, what, what do you guys need to fix to make to get back to the way that you were playing? Well, I think we've got to get skating faster. I, I think we're going to play the game faster. Our exit's going to be faster. And uh, our four check, second man quick, uh, uh, more energy. Uh, you know, that's what uh, we'll discuss. And uh, just moving forward and uh, wait, wait to figure out who we're playing and then uh, Get to work then, but uh, part one's done. Uh, so we're 16, 10, and one. Uh, pretty good job, I think, by the guys uh, getting into that spot. Because if we're sitting here and we're knocked out of playoffs, what are we going to say next? So let's be pretty excited. John, knowing the team that you first took over and to get to this point, you saw an emotionally drained team. Did you see maybe them getting a little drained trying to get into the postseason? Yeah, just a little bit. But I mean, uh, you know, the bottom line is we we have to play better. We know that moving forward. Uh, we, mission one's done, you know. Getting to the playoffs is uh, big, like we said, but uh, we want to be playing better going into the Calgary game and going into game one. Did you ever have a question that you could get that team on day one that you took over into the playoffs? Uh, well, we know they've made it the last few years, so the, they were capable of it, and I, I think they proved that. I, I think everyone's missing the point that they, you know, there have been different peaks and valleys this year, but the the, the bottom the you know, bottom line to it all is we peaked at the right time and uh, we got into the playoffs, and that's a big thing for the team. Potentially nine days until the next truly meaningful yeah. game. Does that help to get the slate cleaned and sure it does. zero and zero? Right. When you well, get to that? I just think that uh, we know what we have to do to uh, win, and we just got to keep applying it night in, night out. Anything else? What will next week be like for you personally, just to coach as a head coach? I'm excited, team? Mike. You know, I, I mean, I'm just, uh, I'm kind of uh, disappointed how everyone's saying we're backing into the play. How do you back into the playoffs going 16, 10, and one? Mm -hmm. You don't do that. The the guys have done a great job. I'm proud of them. Uh, you know, they could have folded when I got here too. So I'm really proud of them.